Well, good morning, or whenever you're watching this. New field, new day. That lets the uh, gang go down. That's for road transportation. And if I can do this one-handed, that puts it in gear. So, uh, we're getting close to getting done. Hopefully get done in this video. So let's get started. started about two hours ago getting sore right here whole side of my face is swollen up so I'm gonna go to the doctor and uh, I'm not feeling good so I don't know if I got a bite or something I'm gonna go to the doctor and uh, may not do any more today well good morning again give you a little look at the corn So I had to quit early yesterday because I hadn't needed to go to the doctor. Um, I had work with bad backs, um, Rocky Mountain fever, COVID and everything else and kept plugging. But what happened yesterday really scared me. And uh, we'll talk about that when we get to the field and get going. Yesterday about 10 o'clock, I started getting sore right in here and a little knot come up. Uh, lunchtime, my whole side of my face was swelled up from my eyes to my ears and it was hard to eat. So I went ahead and finished the field I was in. It kept getting worse. I've never had nothing like that happen to me. So uh, I didn't know what was going on. I went to the uh, emergency room, not the emergency room, the walk-in clinic, 
and um, they done a few tests, test me for strep. I don't know why, but um, it seems that my lymph nodes are infected, and uh, right now we're treating it with it, uh, for an allergy. So they gave me some uh, amoxicillin. And I've been taking allergy medicine and I feel 100% better today. Uh, swelling went down. I'm still sore right in there. Uh, a little, still a little inflamed, but uh, swelling overall has went down. Um, I've got to go for an ultrasound on my jaw Wednesday. So maybe it's just allergies, but it scared the crap out of me because I, I didn't know what was going on. Thought I'd share that with you. I don't know how well you can see it, but this road has got a curve up to it, and up at the end is the famous curve where the hay rolled off. So I don't have straight lines. I've got a, a identical curve here. And it's going off my hand-driven mark so it's not the straightest curve in the world but it's working and it's taking a lot of uh, relief off me keeping trying to figure out where I'm going so we're steering on our own if you know you know my favorite part of the field going around this one dang pecan, pecan, pecan tree, however you say it. Just lovely. So I've got to deal with it in three different passes. Uh, I'm barely going to have to move over for this one. And the third pass. We are past it now. I've got me a GoPro coming. And I'm going to try to get my other one going this weekend. So maybe the footage will be a little bit more um, exciting in the next video. I only got a few passes this way. So I got this little anchor spot over here to do. But, uh, we're just about done in this field. The third good morning of this video. So uh, we should get done with beans. We just got this one. It's actually two farms that's together up here. And uh, if my batteries look good on my drone, I may throw the drone up later on. But uh Let's get down here to the field and get everything, get it in gear and get the valve turned and do it to it. So there's an imaginary line that separates these two fields. And there's the line for real. I've got a landmark down on this end and a landmark down on that end, one of them trees, that separates these two fields. So what I did is I put an eight point down here at the landmark, drove all the way down back there, and hit my B mark. So voila, I come up with my lines. There's a ditch there, so I need to get off and pay attention. Got a little cleanup to do uh, this winter, looks like. Should have done caught that. I think I did when I sprayed and thought about coming back over here and forgot all about it. Um, I've mentioned it, yeah, I think, in this video. It's election time. We've got county executives wanting to promise us everything. 
and uh, it's been pretty known how I stand. I like keeping things rural. Um, I just got a text from one of the ex-mayors of one of the towns here in, uh, uh, here in Lawrence County. And uh, the county executive that I'm going to vote for wants to uh, take a picture of something with me on a tractor. So if that happens, that's going to be pretty cool. There's an update on her corn. I think I gave update on it whenever we were uh, spraying this field here for burn down. And I think I even filmed some when I sprayed the corn. That's some good looking corn out there. Not all of it looks that good. Fill up time again. Well, I went to lunch and come back and my dang auto steer is not working. Don't like much getting done, so you know how it is. I'm gonna go down here to the end of the field and uh, reboot it and see what I can do. Just a simple little reboot. We back hands free. Well, I got this little strip and we'll have this this field finished and we'll have to go over there to that one. Um, I do have battery on my drone, so we're gonna throw the drone after we get the headlands over on that. We'll throw the drone up there.
been in this same video for two or three days since I've had my little spill, my face uh, swelling up. Everything's back to normal. The antibiotics are working. The allergy medicine's working. So I've been feeling better than uh, I have to. I guess allergies have really been uh, taking its toll on me and I wasn't, didn't realize. Um, the drone footage, yes, I did include the hay raking and hay, hay rolling. That's some neighbors of mine. Um, just to break up break up the month but not near the bean uh, plant so I hope y'all enjoyed that I got this tractor ready for today uh, about 8 o'clock last night when it cooled off yesterday was Sunday so I didn't run and one thing I forgot to do was uh, blow out the radiators and the coolers and stuff because this turned hot uh, it's not just unbearable on here, but it usually cools, cools a lot better than what it is. So, I'm about done planting beans. So, we're going to get ready for wheat, and I'll blow everything out, wash everything out good for uh, whoever's running the grain car. Maybe me some, maybe Craig some, maybe Dad some. Or whoever just happens to show up. wipe the dust off and that is a wrap well that is a wrap for uh, 2022 full season beans or I say one season beans or one crop beans because it ain't early anymore but corn's growing uh, that was planted about a week before this one. So that's not ours. So, uh, tried mixing some things up in this and then, uh, not being as repetitious as it may be. So thanks for watching. Um, leave me a comment, thumbs up. Uh, thank you for subscribing and we'll catch you on the next one.